What do you see as the next big cyber attack? We've seen definitely in the last months many hackers are actually looking at companies that cannot have downtime and they are focusing with ransomware attacks. The national health services in the UK, many private companies also in different industries impacted by these attacks. Guess what? They have to be prepared for this. At the end of the day, most of these companies didn't have the option to avoid to speak this and they decided to pay these hackers. Guess what? You are encouraging them. What do you need to do? You need to be very prepared. You need to prepare your people, you need to prepare your defenses and that's what's going to be the only defense you will have for these attacks. Well, so when's the next attack coming? I mean, obviously you can't tell us a time and a, and a place and who's actually going to do it, but you know, when do you expect the next big thing? There are things happening at this very moment. Not only from Asia, from America, from Europe, that it's happening at any given time. Major attacks, we don't know it can happen any time, but as I said, attacks are happening at all times and people need to be protected on a constant basis. So we're not expecting for a big event. People think about the U.S. eventually it's going to be an attack on power plants, energy plants. We might see that, but nonetheless, private companies are always attacked and they have to be prepared for that. Edgar, let me ask you, what is the silliest mistake that companies make? when it comes to uh, preparing or uh, guarding against uh, cyber attacks? The silliest mistake is to receive an email that looks authentic and then downloading a file and then installing malware in your system. That's an opening door that actually it's a cause of most of the attacks that we've seen. So some attacks are DDoS, distributed denial of service, when everybody's trying to access a website at the same time, stopping it or slowing it down. But the other attack that is most common is when somebody downloads a file